Hi everyone, we are starting the second round of what is a 24-man competition happening here at Diplomat Billiards Cafe in Kajansi, near Kampala, the capital city of the East African country of Uganda. The players on the table are Kalima Paul, it's the first game on the table on the match of the match, he is taking on Ibrahim Sejemba and they are racing to five for a place in the quarterfinals, my name is Peter Chobe. It is 0 0. Kalima Paul against Sejemba Ibra. Kalima on table trying to take the first game. I will be back shortly.
in the meantime, on table right now is Ibrahim Sejiamba trying to capitalize a failure by his opponent, Kalima, to finish, which Kalima did not. This is confidence at its best from Ibra. It was a very risky shot because it ended up opening up the black. So means Ibra must have voted or else would have lost. But the follow-up shot is not the best. We are at Diplomat Billiards Cafe in Kajansi in Kampala. I'm hoping that you are watching good images where we are today. The network seems fine. The lighting of the venue seems fine. I do believe that you are watching good pictures than some of the times I can see the pool table occupies more than half of your screen that means you can see as big a table as you probably can it is ibra most likely about to make it one zero all he needs is to roll the white ball following off the cushion that is perfect shooting he's about to make it one zero yes ibra one paul kalima zero Thank you for watching. Just one from played, and it we are over 450, closing in on 500. It's time I Thank you for watching, Kapila Changa. You say Ibra sometimes makes useless defense. Let's see how it goes for him today. At least he's he's showing signs that he's back into competitive action. Robert, Robert, you are appreciating your, the network. Kenneth Biaruhanga, you are asking for when Kasozi is playing. Kasozi is at the venue. And he is already in second round. God willing, we shall have his second round game streamed live. Shims Kapila, thank you for watching. Paul Kalima is playing. This is lovely skill by Ibra just to close the table with the yellows. Remember when the table is open, you are free as a player to use yellow and put red or use red and put yellow either way. The ball that goes in is the choice of balls you play as long as only one color of balls goes in. Kalema Paul missed the last tournament organized. That was on Sunday at Amigos. He played, however, in the, on Friday at Vlaga, lost in the first round. Today he is in round two. So is Ibra, the last two tournaments in which Ibra participated. There was a quarterfinal defeat to Lokomo Hazard in the Amigos Open. Hazard was the eventual winner, while the previous competition at Vlaga on Friday, which was not streamed on this platform because we were, I was handling the National Open, Ibra actually won it. Good shooting. A shot that makes uh, the table finishable. Long range on target with the white ball opening up the black. At times he shows glimpses of his very best. Only that he's not yet consistently 
performing as he used to one or two years back. A good sequence of shots taken so far. This is very encouraging from this young man right now. What he needs is one relatively big shot, white off two cushions, and perfectly to put the yellow in the corner pocket with the white for black coming only naturally. This has been a wonderful clearance from Ibra. A game like this is him at his very best. Hopefully he can maintain this pattern for the entire tournament. Thank you for watching Malcolm Julius. Semanda Elias. Matenga McDickens. Chewine Jose. Paiva McDonald from Mozambique. Kalawa Justin from Zambia. Maxwell Odeka from Nairobi in Kenya. Deo Kano is asking if Chandiga Caesar is still in. Unfortunately, Caesar has pulled out at just around the start of the tournament we shall see him a little later not today joshua Moshenko is saying good shooting yes i believe this has been a very wonderful clearance by ibra Yes, Keith Timber, thank you for watching. Jack and the Bellis, you're asking about the scores. Kindly look at the center top of your screen. The scores, the scoreboard is visible in my opinion. And the scores in blue are for Kalema and the scores in red are for Ibra. We are racing to five. Gift Mosanda and Jevo uploading Ibra's finish. I do agree with you. It was a very good clearance. Tinko, Tinko, thank you for watching. Francis Rugambaje, stop your comedy. Wesley Raymond Jr., are you supporting Kalima Paul? I know he's your friend. Tell us who you are supporting. Haha, <laughs> Fabian Magesa, you said this is your favorite spot. Thank you for watching. Papa Domi, you are watching Ibra here. You are watching from Dubai. Thank you for watching. It is Kalima Paul. He must play like he badly needs his game. As he must play that his entire tournament depends on it. Otherwise, if he goes three down against a clearly better shooter, it will be very unlikely that he will come back in this match. Bali Southerns, you are watching from Zambia, Chipata. Thank you for watching, Butwa Jr. You are watching from Canada, as if there is Canada in Hoima. Thank you for watching, Martin D. Pro. You say you are Ibra's number one fan from Man from Bali. Ahereza, you are in Wakiso. Thank you for watching, Fabian Magesa, Rama Omonya, Mekinawa. It is a midweek competition, ladies and gentlemen. A 24 man tournament happening in Kajansi, a town in Uganda, alongside Entebbe Road. In fact, if you enter Uganda by air in about 15 to 20 minutes, you are in a town called Kajansi, and the biggest pool arena in the town is Diplomat Billiards Cafe, where we are. Five pool tables in place, only Super League. If you know Super League brand of tables, they are the most popular brand in Uganda. You also find them the best.
Lokovi za Henry <laughs> near scoreboard. Yeah. The intention is to differentiate the colors like some of you demanded earlier on. Anyway, watching from Ghana is a free Monica. Wonderful to see a lady watching. I hope you play pool, Monica. Watching from Zambia is Makupa Maya. It is Ibra trying to play a combination shot, which will almost be a game-winning shot if he pulls it off and he fails to pull it off. It's a foul advantage. Paul Kalima. He gets the opportunity he has been longing for in this frame. It will not come easy for him to finish off the red, the yellows in his current visit, though they are two. But at least he should be in good position to put himself in a game-winning position, even if he does not finish it off in this visit of the table. If we can put the yellow on target, the yellow, which is not resting against the cushion, the one which can be portable in the corner pocket, he goes for the center pass first. And he puts. I'm not sure about his height. He probably intended for the two yellows nearing the corner pocket. Now it is very unlikely that he can put any ball because he's snookering the two. And yet the passage of the other yellow, which you can see clearly, is blocked by the black. If he can put it off the cushion, he will be good to go, though it won't come easy. Following from Zambia, Banda Johnny. Watching from Barbados, Spina Shamira Ha. Makoti Bablaze, you are uploading the shot. Abidemi Adetunji, you are watching from Nigeria. By the way, welcome all Nigerians nowadays who watch these streams. Not a bad defensive shot from Kalima Paul. At least he's restricting Ibra's options. He's restricting him only to one ball, which is also, also not easily portable. Ibra responds with a good defensive shot of his own. What can Kalima do? Maybe he's trying a super slice of the yellow ball in the corner pocket right of your screen. The slice was sharper than he even intended. And he gives opportunity away to his opponent. If I had missed, you are saying Caesar is the best. One day, Becky Strayo. Thank you for watching. Innocent Mlanga from South Africa. Gora Dekato from Senegal. Nais Tenson Nyambilitso watching from South Africa. Joseph Manyama from Zambia. Clement Tom from Zambia. Mokasa Erisa. You are saying Ibra is preparing for the big one in Nairobi. Today he has confirmed his participation by paying up. So he will be there. Not bad shooting, I would imagine he will put in the corner pocket with white following the red such that he can put the black. Very good shooting. This guy is shooting so well today. Score is now 3-0. If he can shoot as consistent as he has, has done in these first three frames, it will be very hard to stop him in this tournament. It will be very hard. A few players can match at this level. There is Mansur in the tournament. Kasos Joseph is in. Lubula Simon, the computer, is in. Ragaba Rashid, the dog city, is in. And a few others, because this country of Uganda is not in shortage of talent when it comes to this sport. Emmanuel is asking if Caesar is playing, and the answer is no, as Kalima Paul fouls on the break puts white and this is looking very dangerous for him the free shot is not all that effective as the game is not as opened up as Ibra thought it would 
he needs a big shot. Maybe he'll play yellow to connect the red. And yes, he closes the table with the reds. Nothing else in his mind apart from going for it. Next should be the red ball in the center pocket with the white following. It's not looking good for Kalima at all. This is a sequence of clearance of four reds, which Ibra can do anytime, any day, anywhere, even if it's the second round of a midweek competition like this one. Four down, three to go. Big up to you, Atinatin, watching from Wakanda. Fabian Magesa, Katamba, Tricia from Namibia. Kat uh, Tricia Katamba is a Ugandan name. We call it Katamba. Look at this. Ibra is shooting so well today. He should go for the black in the center pocket. To make it four and yes he does scores are uh, right now four zero it is so far one sided Sishikolo Tombo you're saying that Ibra the magician is at work The next stream should be maybe computer versus Rashida. As you see, Ibra breaking for the win now. A bit of light deflection on the scoreboard, but I believe you can identify that the red figure is a four and the blue figure is a zero with Ibra leading four, zero. Watching from Zambia, Nathaniel Nabzmut. Kalema from, is being supported by Masaka, Uganda, of course, his birth district. Uncle Ham is applauding Caesar. When Ibra breaks and puts, Statistics in previous long races show that he's the most dangerous player in Uganda when he breaks and puts. He normally wins long races by creating a gap on his opponents in terms of number of frames won on the break. Frames won and run on the break. And going by what we have seen so far today, this one should be one of them. There we go. This clearance he can finish even with his eyes closed. That's it. Hard luck to Kalima Paul. This is an obvious black. Ibra will play in the next round. He will face the winner between Lawrence Sengonge and Sam Mohozi. I remain Peter Chiove. We, we meet in the next match. May God bless you.